Hi guys, in this video, I am going to discuss about how to run JavaScript program or course inside Notepad++. So right here, let's open Notepad. So here, so that software that I already downloaded. Now here, this is the very simplest process to execute JavaScript. And here, this is the code. Here, let's copy. And here, paste. So, and here, uh, for JavaScript code, if you write a script tag, so inside a script tag, whatever the content, so that related with JavaScript. Now, here, after I'm going to save. So, if I click on the save here, that asking about where do you want to save. So, I'm going to save at here on desktop. And here, let's skip the location. So, at here, giving block in the and here at this point, so giving add here the file name b one dot html. So this HTML extension must be there. Now here after when that done here after let's go to run and here click run and here you need to search the file. So that's the file that I uh, said add here block in the now here. Select all file and your v1 is my file. Now when that done here click on run. So add here by using a1 tag or message hello world. Now let's execute once again. Here you can see hello world. That's the best line. Now here after let's do one thing. Here for HTML tag, this is H1, S2 is the HTML tag. You can execute this one also. So we need to enter this outside of a script. Now here control S and here to run and here run. So here you can see if I click on OK here, hello world. So this is H1 and here S2 tag, it's a display. Now here after there is the other example add here. For JavaScript, we need to use the code inside at a script tag. Now here I'm going to remove this point and here save control S and here after run. And here click on run. So add here hello world h1 tag here s2 tag and here this is the code add here javascript code so by using for this code add here it's a printing even key number here so if you're a beginner you can use notepad plus plus for javascript okay so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next video thank you